go. Oh, is that clear? All right, well, just picked up my kids from school. And while I was picking them up, um, I totally forgot I bought one of these new NRS Chinooks for the 2019 models. And I want to go ahead and create a video on a side-by-side -side comparison between these two. I have the older version right here and the newer version. And we're going to talk about what are the difference between these two. And the older version, they're on sale right now at a lot of places because they're discontinued and replacing with this one right here, which is the new one. I picked this up from Headwaters. And as you can see, they're pretty similar, but I'm going to show you the, the differences between the two and why I believe this is a lot more comfortable. And now the old ones as you can see a lot of people have this this is one of the most popular nrs vests on the market especially for kayak fishing this is a fabulous vest because it's comfortable i mean i wear this out in the water and i totally forget that i'm actually wearing it but there's always room for improvements uh along with this old one over here what was really popular with this is that it had storage pockets everywhere and you know with the kayak fishing um you need some pockets to hold some of your tackle maybe in pliers but especially your phone um, because you need your phone to take pictures when you uh catch your fish and i usually use this area here this thing right here i'm not sure if it's for hooking up your phone but it was pretty helpful when hooking up your phone to this and make sure that it's not going to fall out and fall in the water. So this was pretty helpful. And it had these pockets over here. But these pockets, they were only open one way. And it was only one zipper. Now, it had this little thing over here for holding your, uh, your knives. I really don't use it at all. But uh, th this was a very comfortable vest. And I highly I recommended it. And it's proven and tested by a lot of anglers. But there's a new one out now, and it's this one. The new Chinook for 2019. Share what's the difference between the two. Now, the first thing that I noticed right off the bat is that it has these pads right here on the shoulder straps. Now, the old ones right here, take a look at the old ones. It was some type of um, belt. And this strap would always get in the way, whatever. Um, it wasn't so much that, you know, um, it, it got in the way, but it was uncomfortable because during the hot summer months, this strap right here would dig into my neck right here. Now having this new one over here, it's padded. Immediately when I put it on, it's completely comfortable. And it also had these little pockets here on the side to put the straps in here. So that way it got in the way. It just looks like it's a lot cleaner look. Also want to share, see this back part over here? Um, it's a lot thinner than, uh, it, it's, I just got paid. <laughs> well, anyways, the back up pad over here, uh, it was a little bit wider. It's and this newer one right here is a lot, uh, thinner. Now here goes another thing I want to share between the two. The new ones have new frame interiors, unlike this old one right here, as you can see. Now this right here, immediately when I put it on, I felt the interior, I was like, wow, this is really comfortable. Now, let me show you the difference between the old one and the new one. Now I put this on, the strap was right here down on the bottom and it hung on and it hung down. You see this little buckle over here? So it's down on the bottom and then you zip it up. And that's how it looked like when fishing. You take a look at the side profile. It was, it was really, really bulky. Uh, the pet peeve with a lot of people that this vest was pretty bulky, but again, I don't really notice it because when I'm fishing out there, I totally forget it, it it's, I have it on. Um, but the side area over here really helped in venting you keeping cool in the hot summer months. Now with this vest right here, I noticed that the buckles are inside and when you close it up I noticed that this vest is less bulkier than the old ones and I'll show you why so I have a gauge over here and we'll put it in inches 
I'm gonna measure the thickness of this padding right here on the top part. It's at around one, almost two inches. You can see that? Almost two inches. Now, with the padding on this new vest right here in the same area, it's an inch and a third. So it's a lot thinner. Let's go ahead and measure the bottom part of the vest. The old one. One and three quarters. The new one. Or a one and eighth. It's really almost the same. It's, I know that this would, if I break this in, it's gonna be a lot thinner compared to this one. And I've been using this vest for roughly a whole year already. And it's, it's I can tell it's worn down. But um, I power washed this, and as you can see, it looks pretty pretty clean again. So, nearly brand new. Now, again, I was talking about this vest, that the zippers only open one way. With this one. They open in two ways now. And these pockets, they open up like uh, shelves, so I wouldn't really, recommending using this as a show but it's pretty nice to have really big pockets over here along with this vest over here it has a plier holder which is pretty cool i really don't keep my pliers there to be honest with you i have somewhere in my bolt i keep it i, I thought that was a cool uh, feature and it still has the pull retainer. So say for instance, I'm gonna go ahead and retie my rod. I can put it here on the loop and then strap it on over here and then retie my lure so it's hands free. So that's cool, it still has that. It still has the little clip retainer slots right here, but it's only one directional, up or down. That's it, it doesn't have it left or right. And the emblems are reflective. Well, one thing I want to go ahead and test, uh, you know, because we keep our phones with us all the time, it does have a retaining po uh, pocket over here to keep your phone. And it has slots over here for pocket knives if you need to put a pocket knife over there. Or if you're like me, you always have a lighter, you put, so, put a lighter right here. And it also has a big pocket here for whatever you want to keep. And a little key retainer over here, you want to put your keys in here. I always keep my keys with me, no matter what. I don't leave it inside the boat, I keep it with me at all times. But this is a huge improvement of the vest. A lot thinner, a lot more comfortable over here. And the neoprene insides right here. It really, really does help. They're co they come in a few different assortment colors. There's gray, there's green, and there's red. They don't have the orange no more, they have red. And I think red looks absolutely sick. Um, I usually wear bright colored vests just in case in an emergency where I need to be located. Uh, the bright colors really help with visibility. I know right now these old vests, they're discontinued and then you could probably find them on sale. If you go at Headwaters, they have them on sale already for like 80 bucks. But these vests alone right now, I believe they're a 110 or 120. But other than that, man, these, this, this new vest, um, I thought the old one was perfect. This one's even better. It's more comfortable, a lot thinner, a lot more. I feel like I have more, more air circulation in the back. And shoot, it's a winner. Give it a shot. New NRS vest is for 2019. Shit. Yeah.